Hello and welcome to the seventh tutorial in the Cocos 2DX JavaScript tutorial series and in this tutorial we'll be looking at jumping a sprite using the jump to method. The jump to method basically allows you to jump a sprite to a particular position. It doesn't matter where it is on the screen or in the game the end position will always be the same but the actual distance it takes will be obviously different because you might be further away. Let's just get into the code itself. We'll be using the source code from Tutorial 3 as the base and there will be a link in the description for that source code and as usual there will be a link for the source code produced in this tutorial as well. What we want to do is go to the myapp.js after we add the sprite we want to create an action for the sprite, I'm going to call it sprite underscore action equals cc dot jump to dot create open bracket first we give it the parameter of how long the animation is going to take put two seconds then we put the end position put 50 by 100 then we put the height of each jump and finally we put how many jumps we want it to take we're going to put three close the bracket semicolon let's just sort out the formatting and now we just need to run this action on the sprite so it's this dot my sprite dot run action open bracket sprite action close bracket semicolon sort out the formatting and now let's just click play now it's going to run in the simulator you'll originally be in the center of the screen the sprite will so you'll come to near the bottom left using free jump so you'll be going down as you can see free jumps and what we'll do and we'll set the original position of the sprite to zero zero to the bottom left and you'll see the end position will be the same but you'll be going up instead and the actual speed of each jump was a lot slower just due to the fact that it was a lot nearer to the end position already there you have it in the next tutorial we'll be looking at the Bezier positioning method the Bezier by method to be precise thanks for watching